Hey friends, how's it going? So today I wanted to do a little video on my own. I'm going to be playing one full round over at the home course with this single disc. This is an Arobi Arrow. This one has never been used before. I found it once in a creek and one of the most beautiful things about it is that it floats. So we're going to give it a shot today. It says ultra straight approach and putter disc. So we're going to see how straight it really is. Wondering if this disc is actually going to be extinct soon. So probably shouldn't play with it. But just All right, so we're going to go out there and get started. All right, so this isn't a hole that's going to be great for this disc. So just playing for the three, see if, if it is going to fly straight. Go right down there where I can see the basket and I'll uh, pitch up from there. Eyes are released. And I keep throwing it on the hyzer. I don't know if the disc is broken or if I'm broken, but uh, I believe it's the latter. Now that putt was super straight. I went straight to the basket. I missed it, but it was very straight. I got most of the way down here, but it's still gonna be a long putt for Birdie. Here's our first par. Not really sure why I brought my bag, but it just felt natural. This hole is 357 feet, so kind of got to try to get it in three best I can to compose. This disc is killing me. I really need to rethink the way I'm, I'm attacking this challenge. Uh, I'm just, I'm trying to throw it too hard. And I don't know, I keep expecting it to flip over, so I'm kind of putting it on hyzer. But that's the thing, it's it's sticking with the hyzer, so I need to throw it flat. Let me figure this out. That was huge. Oh, I'm so happy that happened. Uh, big old step putt and it stayed so straight. I just threw it up right above the basket and it came down right into it. Yeah, baby. Let's go, we are on the board. Well, not, not below par, but we're on the board with a birdie. Okay, so this hole is par four, 650 feet. So if I do a little math, if I'm trying to get there in three, then I have to get like 100 feet I have to get like 200 and something feet per shot. Uh, let me see what I can do. That was a straight throw. It was about 120 feet, but it was a straight. Um, I was stuck in the trees over there, so I couldn't get a run up or anything. And uh, yeah, it goes straight, baby. I'm getting it. Um, I just absolutely yammed on that disc and it didn't go anywhere left or right. That thing was straight as a biscuit. Okay, all right, we're gonna figure this out. Even though we're shooting for four right now from 300 feet up. Looking like a single bogey, I will take that. Kept it right on the fairway. I uh, got caught up in some mud. Uh, have a long look for Bertie. How many of you guys camera skills? Cool. Sign him up. Yeah, hold up. Give me a second.
Uh, I think this course is just too long for it. Like I should have played like a little par three course that you know has a couple holes where I could probably score. But oh well. I tried the forehand and honestly it felt really good, but I got hung up. All right, let's try to keep this one out of three. Just a hair away from OB. Oh, I so Guy was just walking his dog by me. Picked up the a Roby. Said, tried to throw it to his dog. I'm like, hey, is that my disc? He's like, oh, sorry, it looked like a dog toy. <laughs> Vertible hold. I think this disc is perfect for it. Put it on a hyzer again. I tried the old tomahawk there, that uh, didn't work out. Just about murked the camera on that shot. Next hole we've got some hammockers in the way, so we're gonna have to try to throw around them. I don't think they'll be an issue. This hole's gonna kill me. Uh, I don't think I have any double bogeys today, so that's good. Um, this might be it. Yo, that forehand was sick. Just stayed right where I wanted it to. Floated right over there. I threw my, I threw it so hard. Any other disc would have fallen over and just curled back in the woods. So. Shout out to you, man. Maybe this disc fixes my forehand. Who knows? You like that shot. Put on a little Anheuser and it just glides to the basket. Oh man, I love this disc. That last shot was amazing. It's really windy out here. It's like 10 mile per hour wind. I just kind of put it on Anheuser and it just stalled out right over the basket and flopped over. So it'll be a tap in for par. Yo, you think you could talk about my disc golf game like that? So some wrap up thoughts on the Aerobi Arrow. Um, I love it. I think it's really fun to play with. It just goes straight. It, it doesn't feel like you're playing disc golf when you're throwing it. It feels like you're just throwing a toy straight forward, which, you know, if it's PDGA approved, then you're playing disc golf. So, I mean, it really takes a lot of the guesswork out of your throws, like your putter throws, so they can't like disappear off the left or right. You can't shank it. Like it's almost impossible to shank it. So. Yeah, I love it. Is it gonna go in my bag? Why the hell not? I suck at disc golf. It can't make me worse. I was gonna throw a couple straight shots, but uh, I don't know. I think I, I threw it plenty for you guys to see what it's all about. So if you can find one, I don't know if they're even still for sale, but if you can find one, I recommend it. So thanks. <laughs>